First, though, a brutal and senseless murder. A 13-year-old girl found in a closet stabbed. The man accused of killing her now in jail. This is News 6 at 5. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. The arrest comes one week after investigators say 13-year-old Rose DeGiusti was followed by a complete stranger and killed at her apartment complex. It happened on the 4th of July at the complex along Rio Grande Avenue. News 6's Laverne McGee has details on the man they took into custody thanks to surveillance video and tips from the community. At the murder scene, detectives found the packaging of a 12-inch knife believed to be the murder weapon. 28-year-old Jerry Doris May was scheduled to make a first appearance in court this afternoon after being arrested last night. Orange County Sheriff John Mina says he's responsible for the murder of Rose De Juiced. They believe the 13-year-old was stabbed to death in her apartment complex on South Rio Grande Avenue on July 4th. The details are gruesome. She was found in a utility closet, stabbed and barely alive. The 13-year-old girl was simply trying to visit one of her friends who lived in a nearby apartment complex. Earlier this week, they released surveillance video showing a man walking out of a parking lot. Sheriff Mina says he apparently used to live in this area. Does the man arrested have a criminal history? He had been arrested for lewd and lascivious behavior uh, on a child. Uh, that case was uh, ultimately dropped to child abuse. Uh, I'm not sure what time or how much time he served, but he does have a history. Our deputies uh, have come in contact with him recently. Laverne McGee, Getting Results, News 6. Now, there is a GoFundMe page that has been created to help with funeral expenses. It was shared by the Sheriff's Office. If you would like to help the family, we have posted a link in the story on clickorlando.com.